My name is Pithi Reddy Mutala Rao, and my father's name is Potaraju. I wake up early in the morning, usually around four o'clock. After freshening up, I begin my day by singing Kirthanas of God Rama while walking through the village streets. As I do so, the locals offer rice into the Aksha part, which rests upon my head. This Vilalj is earlier, Haridasu was my uncle. He liked my behavior and chose me as his elder daughter's spouse. And in order for my family to exist, he proposed that I come to this, the village as Haridasu, and earn some money to support my family. I solely focus on Rama Nama Smarana when I wear the Akshaya Patra. Some devotees joyfully offer me gifts, while others believe I am exclusively visiting their village and not traveling elsewhere. I don't mind either way. Your offerings bring me joy, but I'm content regardless. This tradition of service was initiated by my grandparents in the olden days when there was no electricity. They would light mustard oil lamps to dispel the darkness, and during those times, my elders would sing bhajans. I was fond of these bhajans and often asked about the meanings behind the songs. My gurus include my father-in-law, Manuri Kutaya, from Anapardi village, from whom I learned. Later, I learned some kirtans from Medisedi Gani Raju of Alamuru village. Additionally, I gained knowledge of Ramadasu Charitra from Chinai Nabeli and Jogi Raju Garu, progressing in my learning journey in this manner. Being a Hari Dasu is also an art form, and I have been practicing it in this village for 45 years. Every year, during the Pongal festival, I used to visit this village for a month. Later on, I settled here permanently. The land where I reside was provided by the washermen, who generously allowed me to build a house on their land. This is where I currently reside. I have crossed 70 years of age, but unfortunately, I am not receiving any pension. This is due to an error in my ADAR card, where my age is incorrectly recorded. I do not possess any other documents to rectify this discrepancy. The reason I stopped this year is that I am growing old and unable to walk long distances between villages. The journey from Teki village to Machara Matla village is five kilometers. Then to Nagula Cheruvu village is six kilometers, followed by Yendagandi village at two kilometers. Finally, returning to Teki village adds another two kilometers. In total, it amounts to a 15 kilometer journey every day for a month. I no longer have the strength to undertake this journey, so I have handed over my responsibilities to another Dasu. To support my family, I have chosen to reside in Kalereo village, a small village nearby. 
ముందు వరకు ఆయన ఎదురు కుట్టడం కొన్నా నాన్న కూడా తిరణా కూడిపోవు ఏదో నా తండ్రి ఉపయోగం కోసం ఏదో చిన్న పేరు అది ఆ కాలేదు ఆ ఊరికని చెప్పి తీసుకున్నాను ఆ ఊరు చుట్టూ మా ఏదో మా తౌడి ఊరు తీసుకుని ఇంటికి వచ్చాను ఇదండి నాకు చెప్తా This is my story. జనపోసగారవ <laughs> వందనము గరి నామ మొదల జిది బ్రహ్మానందము రామాడమ్మ సీతమ్మ వలసిన గోపన్న తలసిన భక్తుల బోసే శ్రీ రామ సంకోచక్రధారు 